human beings have always been engaged in the pursuit of expansion and advancement, and one of the significant hurdles is the acquisition of sufficient energy to travel beyond our solar system. The Kardashev scale is a measure of the amount of energy a civilization can harness and use. We currently are at level zero, utilizing only a tiny fraction of the available energy. Our next target is level one, where we can control the entire energy output of our sun-hitting planet Earth. Achieving this level would enable us to support potential interplanetary travel, allowing us to explore and colonize the universe further. After Kardashev level one, we would then strive for level two, energy control of the sun via a partial or complete Dyson ring. Welcome to life's biggest questions. Let's talk about what if we could harness the power of our sun. Let's dive on in. A Dyson ring is a hypothetical megastructure that involves a vast swarm of solar panel satellites surrounding the sun, extracting and transmitting its energy to the Earth. The concept was proposed by physicist Freeman Dyson in 1960, and since then, scientists have explored the idea further. A partial Dyson ring is a miniature version that could be more realistic as it is easier to build and maintain. It involves a ring of solar panels that fully encircle the sun, but with gaps allowing spaceships to pass through to gather energy and fuel from the station. The gaps are also needed to let excess heat from the sun vent through the Dyson structure, as opposed to the structure having to absorb and dissipate the heat via cooling. The construction of a partial Dyson ring would be a monumental feat of engineering, requiring vast resources and careful planning. It would take a long time to build, with each solar panel module needing its own propulsion and guidance system. A team of self-guided robots would most likely be responsible for assembling the Dyson ring and placing the solar panels. Solar panel production would need to increase 1,000-fold on Earth, with different designs being tested to optimize their efficiency. The partial ring would require regular maintenance and repair to ensure it continues to function optimally. Most likely maintenance would be performed by sentient AI robots. Once completed, the partial Dyson ring would could provide reliable source of energy for spacecraft, allowing them to travel vast distances. The station would function much like a petrol station, but instead of fossil fuels, it would supply spacecraft with its energy needs. The energy could also be beamed back to and used on Earth or other planets in our solar system via high-powered lasers. The station would be a hub for intergalactic travel, with ships continuously stopping for refueling and maintenance. The space station could feature rest and relaxation spaces for weary space travelers, as well as facilities for entertainment and recreation. It would be built to withstand the perils of space travel, including radiation and debris, ensuring it operates safely and without incident. In addition to supporting space travel, a Dyson ring would also have applications on Earth. The station could supply enough energy to meet the energy needs of humanity for centuries or even millennia, enabling us to reduce our carbon footprint and transition to a cleaner, more sustainable future. It could also serve as a backup energy source in the event of catastrophic events, such as natural disasters or power grid failures. A downside to the ring might be dimming of the sun towards Earth, though. However, the construction of a partial Dyson ring would not be without its environmental concerns. The solar panels would need to be manufactured, which could lead to the exploitation of rare minerals and increased pollution. The construction process would be energy intensive, likely requiring more energy than the station would eventually provide in the short term. Additionally, the partial ring may potentially disrupt the natural balance of the solar system. Thus, the design and implementation of the partial Dyson ring must be scrutinized and evaluated carefully. The ring would have to be a century type of project where generations must maintain it in order for it to fully serve its purpose. The concept of building a Dyson ring around the sun is an ambitious and exciting prospect. It represents the technology and engineering capabilities required to propel humanity to the next level of the Kardashev scale. And if built properly, could be a beacon for intergalactic travel and the future of clean energy on Earth. While the construction process must be carefully planned and executed to mitigate any potential environmental concerns, design and innovation will undoubtedly lead to transforming the future of humanity in ways we've never imagined. I hope you enjoyed the video today. Please be sure to drop any comments and suggestions for future videos down below.